So, you've been working on yourself. You've built up a great physique and you dress to impress, but now the only thing that happens is you find women keep staring at you. Yes, this should be a clue that she might be somewhat interested in you, but many men don't know what to do when they go from being the hunter to the hunted. You see, women also have the same demeanors as many men and will stare at you if they find you attractive. Granted, she might take a different approach in how she stares at you, but it's something you might need to get used to, especially if you've been working hard to improve yourself. Today, we explore some of the mistakes that most men make the moment they notice a woman is interested in them. In most cases, it's often an indicator that she's attracted to you, but since men don't have experience being hunted, they often mess it up. But what does it mean when a woman stares at you? Why do people stare at each other? When it comes to people staring at each other, it's quite a fascinating story. You see, men and women are alike when it comes to spotting someone they desire. When they do, they'll want to figure out why this person is so attractive to them. What follows is the stare that occasionally might seem weird. We have our attention drawn to the things we desire, and you can see this when you're walking through a museum and a painting pops out. What you will inadvertently do is stare at it subconsciously each time you walk by. This is a clear indication of interest, and your mind is building up numerous questions. Since we, as human beings, hate unanswered questions, we will continue to stare at what grabs our attention. Now, women are the same. If you've been focused on improving yourself and how you look, you are very likely to find that women stare at you more often. The question here is, what should you do, or rather, what should you not do if you also like her? Well, we've identified six things that you have to avoid doing if you're truly interested in a woman and she's staring at you. The ideal way you want to go about this is to treat it like a scared feral cat that you're trying to make comfortable and allow to like you or get close to you. But what you should avoid doing is just as important. Let's dive in. One. Please hit the like and subscribe button for more if you are enjoying this video. One. Thank you. Break eye contact. One of the things you should avoid doing when you notice a woman staring at you is being the first one who breaks eye contact. You see, women are often those who have to submit as a way of showing that you are the one truly in control. Holding eye contact is a way of showing dominance and that you are not intimidated by her staring at you. What you'll notice is that eventually, she will break eye contact and this is when you can look away. This will often happen in just a couple of seconds, but you want to show her that you have seen her staring at you and you are wondering why. If you do happen to get her to break eye contact first, you will also notice that she will stare at you again sometime later. Once again, the same principles apply and you will need to hold eye contact for as long as possible. Ideally, this is when a charming man who's been following this channel should have an idea of how to approach her. Yes, the constant staring is a clear sign of attraction, and one thing you want to do is be the one making the first move. Regardless of who a woman is, women rarely make the first move as this has been ingrained in their DNA. If you choose your opportunity wisely, you should be able to know when the correct moment is for you to make the approach and strike up a conversation. 2. Simply ignoring the gesture. While it might seem very tempting to simply ignore the gesture of her staring at you, it doesn't yield you any benefits to simply let it go. What is bound to happen is someone else might come by and steal her attention, and since they're actually responding, she will feel more comfortable and you will have ultimately lost your shot. Instead of simply ignoring the staring gesture, there are a couple of things you can do. Number one is to have a smile and smile at her. You can follow this up with a wink as well, but the main thing is to acknowledge the fact that she's been staring at you. The idea is to communicate with her without using any words, and this can be done through gestures or even some facial expressions. You want to make sure that she's comfortable enough for you to approach her, and she should not feel embarrassed about being caught staring. Now, this all depends on whether you find her attractive or not, as some of the most attractive women rarely even focus on the men around them, knowing that the attractive man will come looking for them in some way. 
The final thing you should do instead of ignoring her is to either go over to her or signal her over. If this happens in a bar, you can use your surroundings to your advantage. This means you can call her over and offer to buy her a drink. You're simply looking for a way to occupy her time and strike up some kind of conversation. So it is important to not ignore any of her advances in this manner, as she might simply move towards someone else and choose to ignore you. You don't want to have her feel like she's embarrassing herself or even put her in any state of discomfort for staring at you. Remember, it's not purposely done. 3. Don't become egocentric. One of the worst things you can do when you notice a woman staring at you is to allow it to go to your head. Many men don't have the luxury of women staring at them, which means they don't know how to act when they see this. They simply see her liking him, and it becomes an ego thing. The last thing you want to do is to embarrass her in some way or make her feel like she's the one responsible for a change in your behavior. This will tell her that you don't have any real experience with women who give you attention, and it might seem like you don't have any dating value. A good quality man will just allow her to stare and focus on himself. He will continue being the normal person he is and understand that it might be the way he currently is that's making her stare. You want to show that this is nothing new to you, and you're used to having women stare at you. What you'll notice is that a silent kind of confidence will radiate from you, and this creates an aura of mystique around you that makes women like you even more. Additionally, you'll notice that she talks about you to her friends, and this can mean that more and more people in the room will stare at you as well. You want to have everyone feel like this is everyday practice for you, and it happens quite often. These additional levels of confidence truly draw people in and will increase your sexual value. So don't let it go to your head and don't become egocentric bragging about this, as it might be at the cost of those around you. You don't want to be the silent stigma male that everyone loves but doesn't understand. 4. Don't fight the urge to stare back. Whenever we stare at someone, it's natural to check yourself and then simply look away. We've already mentioned that you should hold eye contact for as long as she permits, but you also don't have to fight the urge to stare back. Since staring is something that is often frowned upon, you will more than likely find yourself and every part of your being telling you to look away. You might just come across as being weird and she might be asking herself why you're staring at her. However, if she's the one who's been staring at you, it's time to understand that this encounter between the two of you is somewhat of a silent dance. This means that both of you are actually communicating in your minds, and it is this form of subconscious communication that is often communicating things that words will never be able to do. What's happening is that you're exchanging information, and if you have experience, your facial gestures can be quite enticing to even turn her on. Your goal is to get her to talk to you as soon as possible, which is a way of truly gauging her real interest levels. So you mustn't fight the urge to stare back. While it might seem normal to you, the act of trying to stare at her without being obvious can often be comical and is not attractive at all. If you like her and she's staring at you, you should continue to stare back. This will also communicate to her that you're interested or that you find her attractive. We've already touched on the wink and slight smirk that can say words about your personality and in many cases, even draw her in. Simply be yourself and have some fun with it as well. 5. Don't become the big head. One of the big issues with modern men is they simply don't know what to do whenever a woman is touting their ego. Many men become so puffed and proud of themselves that they simply act out of character and their levels of self-confidence can rapidly rise through the roof if they're not careful. It's very important to know that if a woman is staring at you, it's no big deal, and you should also treat it as such. Don't do the whole hey baby routine when you think she likes you. Instead of being confident, this can come off as very arrogant. She's staring at you for a reason, and it's not for you to change your personality in any way. Additionally, Many men might become so self-absorbed that they tell everyone around them, forgetting that this is a silent form of communication that could lead to something even more beautiful. 
She's also taken a risk by doing so, as she might be judged by those around her since women should never be the ones making the first move. The best course of action is to just accept it for what it is. It's no different than having a random stranger stare at you. You can simply ignore them or walk away if you feel a little threatened. However, it's best to simply be yourself and continue to focus on what you're doing. The occasional reciprocal act will be enough to keep her attention. 6. Nodding repeatedly. The act of nodding at a woman when she's staring at you might seem natural. In fact, people often nod at each other when they catch someone staring at them as a way of acknowledging that they've been seen and that the other person might be fine or a little uncomfortable with someone continuously staring at them. However, Continuous nodding shows a lack of confidence and a little insecurity. In fact, it might show that you're a little uncomfortable with her staring at you, and this is what will often turn her off immediately. If you're going to nod at her, you should stick to a single nod to acknowledge that you have seen her and that you are completely fine and confident with the fact that she's staring you down. Also, you don't want to approach her with the demeanor of, what are you looking at? This is perhaps one of the most important things to keep in mind. Always try to focus on keeping things as natural as they can possibly be. Whenever a woman is staring at you, it is most generally a good sign, and it also means that she's checking you out. With women now having so many options in men who pursue them, this is quite a rare phenomenon to occur. But once you notice this, you'll eventually need to approach. Thanks for watching to this point. Share with us your experience on this topic in the comment section below. Be sure to join our community for more related content if you haven't done so by clicking on the subscribe button now. See you in our next video.